Yves Saint Laurent was inspired by art. The French fashion designer's creations often mirrored his favourite artworks or echoed their essence through colour or pattern. Painters including Braque and Picasso infused Saint Laurent's creative vision. He never copied but reinvented in his unique style. The Pompidou Centre is one of six top museums in Paris showcasing the influence of art on the designer. He was picking up different kind of inspirations from the contemporary artists like Warhol or Wesselmann or Roy Lichtenstein, but also modern artists, Matisse or even Fernand Léger. We could say he had like a museum without walls in his mind. This Pompidou curator says the exhibition illustrates how fashion can be an art form. It's an honour for us to have Yves Saint Laurent's creations alongside our permanent collection in the Pompidou. And I think it's the first time the show has made a link between the designer's work and contemporary art. Yves Saint Laurent's love affair with art is nowhere more evident than in his Mondrian-inspired dresses, a tribute to the Dutch artist, daring, playful and modern. They caused a sensation when revealed in 1965. As well as the Pompidou Centre, Paris's modern art museum, the Orsay, Picasso and YSL museums are all part of the exhibition, but the most prestigious is the Louvre, where some of Saint Laurent's most luxurious and intricate designs reveal his passion for ornamental art and all things gold. I think the absolute dream for him would have been to be exhibited, for his designs to interact with his sources of inspiration. It's a dream he never imagined would actually happen. Saint Laurent revolutionized women's fashion. He gave women beauty, but also power. He challenged ideals and upset stereotypes. 60 years after his first fashion show and more than a decade after his death, Dozens of Saint Laurent garments and 300 designs will be on show, an enticing tribute to one of the world's most revered designers. Natasha Butler, Al Jazeera, Paris.